Hello YouTubers, welcome to my channel NetSec. This is Johnny. In today's video, I would like to share a way I just learned how to expose your internal web applications to internet. That is Cloudflare Argo Tunnel. The beauty for this way is the simplicity. No firewall rules, no port to open, no account need to create, and it can be accessed in anywhere in the internet. In one of my old videos, I shared you to using Anglog to do same thing. Actually, there are many other ways you can do this tunneling. You can use FRP, Fast Reverse Proxy, Local Tunnel, MPS, or even with SSH Tunnel, etc. etc. There's a lot of software that can do the same thing. But I will say Cloudflare Argo Tunnel is the easiest one to use and the simplest one to set up. Let's start it. This is free Argo tunnel from Cloudflare blog. You can see it has been out in the market for two years, almost two years. Before we go into set up this free Argo tunnel, I want to show you other ways to present your internal web applications to internet. Before I had a video to use Anglog, and also I have a post about uh, how to expose your internal service to public internet. You can see Anglog FRP local tunnel and lots of others. I was showing here, team viewer and desk, go to assist VNC, Citrix go to my PC, XT800 splash top, U VNC, real VNC and some others. Zero tier and clock. I know there's another one which is new is MPS in GitHub. I may have another video for that as well. But the problem is some of the setup is quite complicated. You need to register account. You need to install server and then client. That's too much. For your simple project, if we can use a uh, Argo then just three steps, two commands, and then you can expose your internal web application to internet right away. Maybe you wanted to do a traditional way, which is set up your DMZ server. This is my router here, 192.168.2.1. Um, if you want, uh, you can set up your DMZ server. I can show you that. I have uh, CentOS, Linux 7, it's running. I have um, Potato Docker running as well. Internally, it's running on 192.168.2.1. Let's log in. So, if you want to expose it to internet, um, for example, that's my public IP. You may can try to access it, but it won't work at this moment because I didn't expose it, you may need to put .11 this IP in here in DMZ and then you need to set up your inbound lure and maybe outbound lure as well. Uh, the potential risk is usually when you set up DMZ server like this on your home router, you basically expose all ports to internet. So it's working. Another problem for this way is that uh, you may facing dynamic IP. Your DNS, dynamic DNS, need to set up. As I show you previously, using uh, OpenWRT, you can dynamically update your uh, DNS A record with your dynamic uh, public IP. So there's too many, too, too many ways to do that, but uh, the simplest way, the easiest way to do is you 
from my point of view here is using Argo Tunnel. Step one, we need to download the Argo package and install it. You will see command from here. I'm going to show you all steps one by one. Download and install CloudField on your machine. We are using CenterOS, Center OS using RPM to manage the package. So what you can do is just simply copy those two commands. So here is the IP 192.168.2.11. Let's try to paste the command. Uh, wget is wasn't installed. Let's uh, get the wget installed first. It shouldn't take more than one minute. Then we will get the packet, then we will run the packet. Done. Step one, finish. Step two, create a tunnel. That's it. We installed the package, then we can use in this command to expose your local host 9000, which is my container port to internet right away. Simple, easy. So we are using port 9000. We just need to change it from 7000 to 9000 and then enter. You will get the URL for you to access your local host port 9000, which is our potential port. So let's the uh, URL. You can use in this random assigned URL to access it. It may need uh, one up to one minute for your new route to become functional. Usually less than one minute. Again, my public port shouldn't working anymore because I haven't expose it anymore. Let's uh, paste URL here. Copy. Going to paste URL. Now you got it. Just to prove that I can use another service I can use another VPC to confirm that I have no VNC in the cloud. We have to manually type it in. So the VPS in the cloud is also able to access this local application. And I didn't create any firewall rule, I didn't do any NAT. Now it's working with that uh, Argo tunnel. Let's log in. It's fully functional. From my opinion, this is the simplest and easiest one to create a tunnel to expose your internal web application. It's great for your small project at home. If you have a Cloudflare account, you can do more here. You can log in or authenticate using your Cloudflare account. Then you can set up um, your using your own domain to set up this kind of thing to access your internal web application as well. That's all for today. Hope you enjoyed it. 
Let me know if you have any questions. Other than that, have a great day. Thank you.